senior night from one of the great venues in the conference, the State Farm Center in Champaign, the 178th meeting between Michigan and Illinois. DJ Karstensen will throw it up. Larry Serrano, Roger Ayers, our officials. The tip is won by the Michigan Wolverines and controlled by Doug McDaniel. Cheddar has the Wolverines rebound. Michigan team has been very good offensively in Big Ten games. McDaniel got hit but scored it anyway. It just doesn't make any sense. Aaron Shannon made a decision. He made a decision he was comfortable with. Had to oh. play. Jet Howard, an explosive two, and the ankles look just fine for Jawan Sun. Taking over leadership roles. We heard a lot from Will Cheddar, the redshirt freshman in practice today, too. Rogers to danger for the stop. Shannon. Shannon. Bursting into Meyer for three. Yes! Illinois has the lead. Great job. Baseline drive, baseline drift. Meyer comes up. Uh, look, we have Harris Reed, really nice job of getting up and underneath Hawkins. The top step back. Hawkins Ooh. hits it anyway. And that's what makes this league so difficult. They play every single day of the week. Danger for two. Howard instead blocked from behind. Taken by Jace Howard. He loses it to Harris. Harris running with Dickinson. Oh, my! Transition right here. Back contest. Really good job again. Stay with the play. Digging the ball out in the post. And then Sincere Harris sincerely finishes the play. This has been the difference in this game. Hopkins all over. Illinois does have the use it or lose it timeout. Still Shannon, still Shannon, and now it is Rogers. Tie over the top. Transition, and he gets to the offensive glass. Watch him right on the left hand, right left hand side of your screen. No one puts a ball. One and one, McDaniel missed it. Dickinson tips it, Williams, oh! That is an emphatic end of the half. Terrence Shannon with a volleyball spike. Dickinson led the way with nine in the first half. Too hot to handle for Cheddar. The 10th turnover led for more than 16 minutes in the first half. Meyer step back three. It's good. And one of the two seniors honored in his final home game. Great pass, Dickinson. Better blocked by Meyer. The stuff on Bufkin. Hawkins running, finding Shannon. Melendez. Oh, goodness. Play, watch him, eyes on the rim, show it, throw that thing out, and take on the big fella at the rim. Woo! And Howard has the rebound. Jed Howard's been really active defensively. Bufkin steps in. Bufkin, tricky finish to tie him. Well, Kobe Bufkin, good things happen. He can rack it and finish it. Shannon's yet to make a field goal, but he's done a nice job of running this team. But when you play him in the point, whoa! Hawkins! Another real line and he's stuck! Okay. Downhill, be the aggressor. Shot fake, forced to close out, lead help. It's kind of a high percentage shot. I think the message at halftime for Brad Underwood was, don't settle. Good, he had surgery to repair a bone fracture in the left foot. Only back the last few weeks. Shannon off a of curl. Hawkins, look out! And McDaniel hoists a three. Shannon got taken down, but Illinois clears the rebound. It's a seven-nothing run for the Illini. Rogers makes it nine. Ten points, one shy of a season high. Williams defended by Meyer. Williams muscles at home. Look at the left hand side of your screen. You've got Shannon matched up again with Hunter Dickinson. They didn't get it to him. Bumpkin deep three. He got it. Bumpkin with 16. It's a two point game. Watch him right here. Coming off of that screen. There's the kick out. Feet underneath him. Knocks down that deep three. Bumpkin off the screen. Bumpkin takes it. Michigan leads it. 10 in a row for Michigan.
Rose again, and it's been all Kobe Bufkin. And get it back to Hawkins. DJ Carstensen says no double dribble. Shannon three to shoot it. Reed came over to block it. We'll go man coming out of that zone. Myers got Dickinson on him. Meyer trying to break down Dickinson. He does just, just scraped it past the onrushing Reed. Reed just fouled him shooting at three, and now it's Hawkins. Tipped to Rogers right by Melendez. Oh, that looked like it was off of Michigan. Watch Melendez in the middle of your screen, just keeping that alive and seeing and reading the play. Three to go. Bufkin fouled and he scores it. Fouled by Meyer. Bufkin with a chance for three. A little step back, creates some separation. He catches the foul and then Melendez, the first guy that was in the gym today for shoot around. Great job of Hawkins getting Dickinson off the, off the block. That's the pass. He really good at throwing that pass. For the tie, Howard hit it. Jed Howard with a three. One timeout apiece. Michigan scored the last seven. Shannon in his final home game. Shannon, Melendez, stopped. Dickinson has it. And Michigan can hold for the last shot. Michigan looking to solidify that large spot. Dickinson in the paint. Dickinson missed it. Rebound grabbed by Hawkins. Hawkins, not close. Wolverines trying to stay alive for the Big Ten title, trying to get a massive win for their tournament hopes, and it's Howard stroking a three in the first shot of OT. Melendez spins on McDaniel. Melendez finishes over Dickinson. All 12 of his points since the break. Had to start because of the injury to Epps. Right block Dickinson again. Backing down and scoring over the top. This two big lineup has been terrific for Michigan. Dickinson again, got deep on Hawkins, might have shuffled the feet, but he got away with it. Jolden already says they'll be in the projected field as of tomorrow. Out of the timeout, Shannon, jumper. Yes. A little bit better defender. A guy that all of a sudden gets up in the transition. And maybe more active defender out of doubles. Dickinson again, he's got 25. Meyer back on the floor for Illinois, which has looked lost offensively for a while now. Shannon draws the contact and scores it. A little bit late, watch the right hand side, how hard he comes off of there. Bad angle by Tyrus Reed, but I mean a really good drive. But I'd like to see this little hand up once again. Get him on the right side of the floor, get him to his left hand. Shannon drops it off beautifully, Rogers scores it! Well, now he gets the switch with Reed. Shannon on senior night. Hop step inside. Got it! Baron Shannon drives it right. Look at his ability to pivot, create an angle. Play through the contact. Really good job of creating the switch. They create the switch. They get the big on small. Shannon gets low. This is awesome, but I'll tell you one thing. Those two guys on the left-hand side of the floor, you have to stay home on. It's the big-time shooters. Baker, three. No, rebound, Harris has it, Illinois can win it, Harris, Rogers, too late. This is why Terrence Williams is in the game, this is ability to defend out on the perimeter. My three-pointer, Illinois strikes first in double overtime. Instead, a step back bumpkin, no, and it's Melendez with a head of steam. It is Meyer, shot fake. He's got Melendez on the other block, but he takes it himself. All right, Brad Underwood going to a hot hand and creating the matchup that he wants. Meyer into Williams, leaning in. He got the roll. His size and length really taking away anything. Dickinson into Hawkins, and Hunter Dickinson with that basket has just surpassed his head coach, Jawan Howard. How physical Hawkins is trying to get Hunter Dickinson off his spot. I mean, this feels like a championship game, and Rodgers is on the floor to get possession on the jump ball. Took him for a second, now Hawkins. Good job of getting him off the block. Now do you double? Watch the, on the left-hand side. Good job right there with the help. Dickinson fouled. He scores. Dickinson can tie it 
with 42.1 to go. He just got a second and third dribble right there without running a double. He's just too big, too strong, too physical. Great patience, and he gets back to his right shoulder. Final home game of a breathtaking college career. No foul called. Bumpkin misses. Illinois survives. A classic between the Illini and the Wolverines. Illinois serves a major dent to Michigan's at-large hopes. Illinois wins its 20th game, and Illinois has just clinched the Big Ten regular season championship. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.